What's going on guys? Welcome back to the Vault Pro Scooters. Today we're here for a custom build and I read the comments and it looks like doing this vlog style custom like I did with Julian in the last one is cool with you guys. So during this weird time, I needed to find somebody that could do a custom build with me and lucky enough, I spend enough time with this man anyways. So I think it's time to intro him. What's up guys? So we're out here still kicking it in California. Riding a little dirty, you know, We've got a little park sesh, but six feet distance, We're staying safe out here, shipping safe. I really got an issue right now with this this whole setup. So I don't, I don't think I'm gonna be able to work like this. I gotta take care of it. Why is this light red? All right, now we can build. Sean Cardwell, AKA the Grape Slushies. That's how you can find me. Hence why we had to make that purple right there. And uh, I think purple is gonna be the theme today. So uh, Austin, you ready to start picking some parts? Yeah, so if you guys watched the last custom build Julian, you pretty much know that I'm going to follow Sean around with his camera and he's gonna pick out parts. We'll come back to the studio and we'll watch him build it. And just in case you weren't, this is not James. Th this I is am not, not James. James, yes. I am not James, so please do not confuse me for James. Let's get Sean, let's go into the warehouse and let's see what parts he has to pick. Okay, we're in the warehouse. Do you have any idea what you wanna use? Dude, I already said it. We had to change the light to purple. I am the purple guy. Grandpa grapes, you already know. So we're gonna go heavy purple. Grab this grip tape right here, which is trans purple. All right, so we got purple grip tape. I don't think anyone's ever used this. I'm gonna use a tilt tomahawk fork. I heard it's pretty good. It'll fit 120 millimeter wheels. And look at that, it's purple. Unfortunately, no purple clamps. So we're gonna do it right. Baby SCS, new style will fit standard and oversized bars. And since it's black, It'll still look good. And since we're right here, can you guys guess which bars I'm gonna use? That's right. We have the Trans Purple Affinity Bars. Last year I did a, a collab with them and before they dropped the purple, the first batch of 50 came out as Grape Gang Bars. So thank you to everyone who bought those. But now Affinity has it always available. I'm picking standard because they're steel, so it should be good. And uh, if you can't already tell the vibe, it's definitely gonna be more on the street side. All right, so for the deck, I wanted the purple deck, and I was thinking the AOS V5 Will Scott, because the pictures look pretty darn purple. Uh, we were sold out of the 5.5, five, unfortunately, but we still have some of the four nines, and I was like, all right, let's crack this bad boy open, look at it. But it's more of an iridescent blue and purple, so it's not gonna fit my theme, but it's also a really sick looking deck. So if you like bluish purple, which, come on, great guy, you got it. <laughs> I recommend picking it up. But I found these three decks right here. So I'm gonna pick the Brian Noise deck, 625 by 22.5. Unfortunately, we don't have the pink fade one anymore. So this one's gonna be black. But like I said earlier, black and purple. And I really wanted to get you a pure purple build, but this is still gonna look sweet. Eventually, we right. already said, as soon as Sean can gather the right parts, he will do an all purple custom build because he has to. For headset, we're gonna go with the Purple Odyssey Integrated. Grips. Uh, a lot of people have been using these lately. Broke Ryford grips. Um, I mean, I don't, not too many people have signature grips in scootering and I haven't seen any of his scooter edits. So, I mean, he must be really good. So after we're done filming, I'm gonna go look up a Broke Ryford, Ry Ryford? Yeah, Broke Ryford uh, scooter edit. So I'm gonna use these guys purple and black swirl, it's gonna look great. Just so we uh, we don't offend anybody down below in the comments, Sean and I are friends with Brock Rayford. It's just him trying to trigger Brock, so don't take offense to that. that he knows he knows that he's being dumb, so. Dude, the kid, they're gonna kill us in the comments. We're gonna get a we're gonna get a comment from Red Bull and they're gonna be like, we hate you. While I do have you guys all here, Sean is grabbing wheels. I really do wanna just say thank you to everybody that is supporting us during this time. We're trying to stay producing content, but we really can only do so much with what we have. And if you guys are liking these videos and the dropping quality isn't too terrible, smash the like button, drop a comment letting us know, and I will try my best to continue producing videos like this. Final part is we're gonna pick some wheels. They're gonna be purple on purple. You might be thinking, who makes a purple on purple wheel? Well, it is flavor. We should have a pair in stock. I do not see them. Let's go check the front of the store. It's basically a ghost town right now. We are fully closed. So sorry if you guys wanna come into the shop. You cannot right now. Uh, but you can continue to order online and we'll still get you your stuff. Do you spy what I spy? 
Yeah, baby. This is actually the last pair. And I gotta say, the color on these, really nice. It's a, it's a little bit different than any purple. I mean, look at the blue and green ones. Just look how good, look how good the color is on the blue oh, and green. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They do really good color. Yeah. So these ones are gonna be the final piece to our purple custom build. What wheels are they? They're Flavor Awakening wheels. And I would say go check them out, but this color is sold out at the time of filming this. Hopefully we get some more. All right, we're gonna go to the studio, set everything up, and get to building. Okay, we are back in the studio, Sean. Mm-hmm. You can tell that purple light back there. I'm gonna make it shine with these purple bars. Really nice, mm-hmm. We have a purple headset to keep it spinning around. The Proto Baby SCS in black. Purple Tilt Tomahawk fork. The Trans Purple Grip Tape. And I am a little scared, I might switch it out. I'm just curious how it'll show up with the Trans. One of the most important parts of every build, every setup, is the deck. And lucky enough for me, there was a Spare Brian Noise deck. And like I said in the warehouse, we definitely got kind of a street vibe here. What I mean, kind of a street vibe. It's a 625 by 225. It's perfect. Let me get this out of the way. I was scared I was gonna knock over a poster. All right, first thing I'm gonna do is check out this grip tape situation here. Do we not have a wrench? There's like, I have these little pliers here. Oof. These should do the job. These will do the job. They aren't the proper tool, but where there's a will, there's a way. We have a full tool chest, but it's locked. I'd love to use these tools, but it's locked to keep people from stealing our tools. I don't, blame, I don't, I don't blame James for locking it. Because... Oh no, not at all. Now here's the question. What will this trans purple look like? Oh yeah, it looks great. Perfect. So we are gonna go with this. And you know me, fold that grip tape. Nah, I stopped at the head tube. But now we can't just have the purple grip tape. We gotta show a little bit of extra grape love. We got some stickers here and we're gonna hide them underneath the grip tape and you might see it. Get some free basil hair. What about like? That's kind of cool. You can, you can do your, it's your build. I think there's gonna be a restock on these pretty soon on the vault. Just realized they're out of stock, so we're gonna get some more for you. Says that he thinks there's gonna be a restock, even though he knows there's gonna be a restock. I obviously know there's gonna be a restock. <laughs> yeah, I you think know, there's it's, a it's possible. Called, it's called suspense. It's called suspense, Austin. I think there's gonna be this possible You should restock. know about suspense, Austin Suspenser. Like that. So now that the essential stickers are basically that's the whole build. That's the hardest part. That's the part you guys all care about. So now the rest is gonna be a breeze. Let's see if we can even see those beautiful grapes. You can barely, it's a secret. Well, we it's haven't even rolled it yet. I could, you can already tell. So they're there. You guys know they're there. I don't even need it. These hands are magic, dude, look at this. You think it's gonna be better? Holy, look how big that dropout is. If you can't 5-0 on this, I'm sorry. Oh yeah, like, oh God, my fingers. Thank you, Austin. We'd be lost without you. Thanks to Austin Spencer's help. All right, there we go. The grip has been applied. It is trans purple, which gives it a really nice deep purple, which I freaking love. Unfortunately, you can't see the grape a little bit. Eh, yeah, I like it. I like it. So let's continue on with the build. I guess we'll just start throwing in the front end. I'm gonna slide this on and hopefully it goes in nice and smooth. Getting that dust cover on, a nice tight fit. We will need a spacer and luckily we have one right here and it's purple. The baby SCS actually comes with a spreader bolt so that's really nice. Now we can pull out our spreader bolt, let it kind of clamp on, try to get it roughly straight. Boom. Let's go ahead and compress this bad boy. And y'all already know the drill. Grease is king. All right, compression is on. Let's get our bolts in there. Do you mind if I stand? You can stand. Thank you. I was feeling limited. Boom. Get that going. Get that guy started. Three bolts and four bolts. Nothing better than some fresh bolts and a fresh clamp. We're gonna grab one of these lovely Flavor Awakening wheels here. Get that guy aligned. Didn't check the bearing slot, but it actually looks pretty good. Yeah, look at that. And Austin Spencer said one tool to get this on. Let's see if he's right. Wow, that actually worked. 
I was doubting him. Look how good that looks. Dude, purple is such a superior color. Yeah, way better than green, especially when it comes to grapes. False. Slide out the axle. And then we can slide in our other flavor wagoning. Ooh, plug. Wow, look at the design of the deck. I actually haven't seen that. How much of it is plug? Yeah, right? That's cool. I know this is. All right, so it takes a little bit longer since it isn't Are you gonna have actually... room to break on? <laughs> I literally, before I went to pull off the axle, I was like, now remember to do the brake first. Try to see if it'll fit, please fit. <laughs> Freaking frick. Hey, I'm yes. scooters, baby! So our trapezoid head, uh, screwdriver, came in clutch. That actually made those holes perfect. I gotta say, this thing is coming out real good. So let's get these grips on. The Brack Ryfords. It's a weird name. Yeah, I don't, I don't know who spelled it. We need some more air pressure. So we turn on the air compressor to fill up some more pressure so that I can get these grips on. All right, easy. The Finity bars, since they're steel and just a T-bar, they make these boys thick. So this one might not fit. Yeah, it's not gonna work. I'd have to grind it down. ODI aluminum. Mm -hmm. Yep. The affinity bars are too thick. They have that really thick crossbar since it's just a T. They want to make sure it's strong, so they have really, really thick crossbar. So instead, we're gonna go with the classic ODI aluminum bar ends. They're gonna fit basically every bar on the market, unless it has an odd design. But ODI aluminum bar ends are a must have. They're gonna last you for years. They're great. Like I said, these will fit almost every Bar, is there any bar that ODI aluminums don't fit? I think even when District had those hexagon ones, those still, still fit. fit yeah. yeah, so psh, ODI aluminum bar ends. Tilt, please come back with bar ends with all those cool colors. All right, let's see if the bars will go in. I'll probably need to, oh. Whoa. Look at that. I did not expect that. Yeah. Especially with the, the layer of powder coat, I did not expect that. Mm, that's just how this thing comes together. I thought you tied it up here so the audience could see. Because Let's go under the table. What are you doing? Let me let me get them started. Because the bars are perfectly straight right now. So I get a little bit snug and then I can move up. There she is. Uh, we usually wait to name them. But I'm thinking this is the grape necessity. Alright, let's see if it's done. Alright, boys and girls, here we go. Listen to that resonant frequency right there. It is dialed, but you can hear that hmm, hmm. And that's just the sound traveling through the whole scooter. Like I can feel it in the bars. Did you hear that? Mm -hmm. That was good. I know we were kind of taking a risk with the uh, trans purple. I was a little nervous, but that dark midnight purple is coming off super clean. Okay, yeah, that's, that's beautiful. I thought like with the purple, 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 purple purple, it'd be a little bit too much. If I did find that purple SES without a purple deck, I think that would have threw it off. But the black baby SES is going perfect. Matte black, matte black. And this thing just screams grape. And also street. I really like it. I really like the purple. Um, it's not like I had like a purple custom build planned out and he took my grips headset and wheels from. I don't, I don't know what you're talking about. Yeah, these yeah, are, yeah, no, it's not like I had that. Banner. These are the last purple wheels. Austin's gonna use it. He brought me in to, to help out with this one. And I was like, can I change the build? Outro. 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 Thanks Outro. for watching, guys. <laughs> Vault Pro Scooters, Austin already beat it like a dead horse. We are sorry it is not professional like you are used to seeing on the Vault Pro Scooters channel. He is not actually Cameraman James. You guys got punked so hard. So after this madness is all done, uh, you know, we just wanna be responsible. Cameraman James will be coming back and you'll see that high quality content again.
Exactly. Sean's links are down below. Make sure you guys check Sean out. All the vault links are down below. Make sure you guys go to the Vault Pro Scooters for all your scooter needs. And uh, we will see you guys later. Peace.